Here in this province, the horse racing industry has made it so attractive for owners to own a BC bread. Why, you won't believe the money you can make once again owning a BC bread. If you've been to the track lately, you've most likely heard the saying, it pays to own a BC bread. We thought we'd look into the benefits of campaigning a BC bread at Hastings. First, to find out how a horse qualifies as a BC bread, we contacted Ralph Jesiak for an explanation. BC bread is, is born here in British Columbia, fold, fold out here, you know, bred here, or it can be bred elsewhere, but it has to fold out here in British Columbia. Or, and uh, that way you race for more money. Just how much does it cost to get a horse to the races? I have roughly about $15,000 into the horse. Okay, and, then, and on top of that, you can add about uh, Fifteen to 20000 to get her to the uh, races. So when you round that out, it's a lot of money. It's a lot of money. It's a lot of money. Yeah. But then you know, I sold a horse last year for 16000 and he's made 140000 already this year. So there was a lucky buyer out there. Leif Nordal gives us a rundown on the BC bred restricted races. There are a number of uh, horses that are for BC bred only which are, you know, the two fraturities, the Sadie Diamond and the Jack Diamond, which are for two-year-olds, and then the uh, Ascot and the, uh, the fraturity are for outside breads, but they're mostly for BC breads. And then there's also the uh, sales stakes, which are two races uh, for the uh, two-year-olds, the Philly and, uh, and the Colt, and then the same for the three-year-olds. So uh, there are additional incentives uh, for owning a BC bred horse. To get a view on running a BC bred horse at Hastings, we met with Hastings Director of Racing Paul Reineveld to get a rundown on the additional benefits. Well, there's actually a couple different reasons why owning a BC bred would be uh, in the best interest of owners. First of all, uh, on every overnight race and stakes race, they run for an additional 13% more. So, for example, on some of our higher level allowance races, they're running for an additional $3,000 to $3,500 on top of the already uh, high purse. Uh, in addition, you have the eight BC, BC Cup races that uh, we run every year on BC Day. And this year, you also had the opportunity for three races down in Washington on their Washington Cup Day. So that's 11 restricted stakes races that you have an opportunity for. Uh, throw in that this year we started the uh, allowance races in the non-winners of two, we gave the BC bred yet another opportunity. It was basically a non-winners of three race for BC bred. So you had two chances to win that race. And we're actually looking to explore other uh, opportunities like that for next year to uh, give more incentive to buy and own BC bred horses. So basically it does pay to own a BC bred? It does pay to own a BC bred, definitely.